the menu tonight. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Craig Anthony and Clark Kellogg. And this place is going crazy. Up next is the three-point contest. The shot that's come to define the modern game. And we'll see some of the premier shooters in the game tonight. And Brent, was it 03 when you participated in the three-point contest? What are your records? So it'll be Peja Stojakovic here. So each player gets five racks along the arc, along with two balls at deep range, and 70 seconds on the clock to shoot all 27. Those deep shots are worth three points. The money balls on their racks are worth two, and the rest are one apiece. Additionally, each competitor makes one of their racks all money balls. So much of your total score comes down to you hitting that entire money ball rack. These guys have to be smart about where they place that one. Not an easy start here. No good on the deep ball. Off the mark with five in a row now. Yeah, he's struggling right now. He's losing his way here. That's seven misses in a row. He's got to speed up. Clock's ticking. That makes it 10 in a row. It's getting worse. It's all just gone to pieces here. 11 consecutive misses. Can't sink the money ball there. Seven. Nine points is what he finishes with. Well, I, I didn't expect that score to be as low as it was. What about you guys? There's nine, so it's Michael Red ready to go. And early on, it's important that you find your rhythm and focus on keeping your shot form intact for the entire round. And these guys are so precise. It's so interesting to watch when a guy misses short on that next shot. Does he overcompensate and shoot it long? I mean, these guys dial it in. Four. Now, this is an unpleasant start. Hits the deep ball. He's at eight points. Gets the money ball. Two racks remaining. He's got 11. And that makes it 12. One rack remaining. impressive number in the end it's a 12 point round for him that's far below what he's capable of doing when he's on his game and here we go with Ray Allen and looking at the setup for this contest it's all about the money balls in my opinion they account for a big chunk of your potential score so you really can't afford to miss those I think guys pick those up and they understand the value of them they might take a fraction of a second more just to focus in. His fourth in a row. Misses for the fourth straight time. you got to get the pace going or he might not make it through the racks. That's seven. He might run out of time. Three racks down, two to go. He's got 11. And he's claimed that numero uno. Only man to sink one there. And he wasn't able to finish that last rack. And he's got 15 points when the round ends. Well, a very respectable performance from him there, guys. And so here's Jones now. 
And you have to keep that pace, right? Running out of time in this competition is a huge disadvantage. You've got to get all those shots off. Yeah, I think tonight we got a lot of guys with a lot of quick triggers, so it shouldn't be much of a problem tonight. Three more points to stay in contention. That's four misses in a row. There's three more to stay alive. Comes up empty on his sixth straight. He just cooled off a bit. There's three more to stay alive. No good with his ninth in a row. He's all over the place. Yeah, he's cooled off here at the finish. Three more points to stay in contention. 13th consecutive miss. Hard to believe. Oh, off the mark once more. He just needs to get this over with. Can't cash in on the money ball. There's three more to stay alive. No good again. He's looking for a place to hide. And with that, he will not advance on to the next round. No, th those results aren't going to cut it. And hopefully next time, if, he, if there is a next time, he'll do a little bit better than that. He'll walk away with just six points in that round. Something went terribly wrong out there, guys, with him in that round. Yeah, never really had a feel for his shot. You know, you come in and you're prepared to show your best. This was not his. And so we'll see Dirk Nowitzki. And hoops is ordinarily a team sport, but not this a bit. This is every man for himself. And where are you going to hide? you got a tank top and barely any underwear on And the spotlight's on you. So shoot it up, kid. Comes away from the rack with zero points. Eight points is all he needs. Two straight tough racks. He's missed all three money balls so far. That's six points left on the table. He needs eight points more. That's four misses in a row. And two. Seven more to keep shooting. He just can't find the bottom of the net with those money balls. He's missed all four. Two racks to go. Seven points more to stay alive. Off the mark with five in a row now. Six misses in a row. He can't get it going. If he misses more than two, it's over. And he's got one rack left. And he couldn't finish the money rack. He collects just three points total right there. He might be a little embarrassed after that showing. Well, he's not a boxer because he wasn't feeling it from his corner shot, if you know what I mean. That really hurt his round. It can be a big advantage going last. He knows the score he needs to beat in order to qualify. Yeah, he, he shouldn't need all five cracks to top that mark. He, he could get there early. Needs seven here. Four. Four more points to advance. Yeah, tough time getting going right now. Just four more points to advance. Off the mark with five in a row now. Four more points to stay alive. And now really starting to get cold. Oh. Three of four on money balls. That makes it one of two from deep. He's got 11. Can't get the money ball to fall. Off the mark with five in a row now. No good on his sixth consecutive shot. He's losing his way here. That's seven misses in a row. He comes away with 11 points. There was just something off about him in that round. Yeah, when you have a stretch of missing eight in a row like that, that that's first out of the gates here in the final round. Can he set a mark that the rest can't match? And once you get to the final round, stamina certainly comes into play, especially the tired leg aspect of taking so many shots by this point. Yeah, it's hard to blame these guys. The adrenaline has kind of come down. Can they settle back in and stay consistent? It's a will to win time, and you got to get that adrenaline back up. He's got three. Drains the money ball. 
Three bad racks in a row. Really tough to recover now. Six. He's at seven now. Just two points there. He won't be happy with that. He misses his fourth straight. Eight. He got three points off that rack. Not bad. Eleven. His finest showing. I think we can all agree he could have done a lot better. So it's Michael Red ready to go. I really like his chances. 11 to score to beat. He's got two. Misses on the money ball. Eight more points to tie it up. Got to get hot. There's four. Five. He's going to need six to get this thing tied up. Three bad racks in a row. Really tough to recover now. Six points more to tie it up. At six. Four more points and it's tough. Can't cash in on the money ball. That makes it one of two from deep. One more to top. 11 points total. One rack to go here. That's 14. He is on fire. And he's got 15 points when the round ends. I'd say a solid showing from him. So it'll be Ray Allen here. He had the highest score in the last round. Let's see if he can do it again here in the finals. And this is within reach. 15 points here. And two. Can't get the money ball to fall. That's troubling. He's got three. U-G-L-Y. He just can't get anything going. Seven more points and he'll tie it up. Nine. Just superb. Well, he's going to tie it with four more points. And that's six in a row. He's made all but one of his money balls. Two away from the win. Up to 15. There you go. He has sealed the win. Now just finishing the string, giving these fans a little more eye candy. And putting second place that little bit more in the rearview mirror. 19. So his final tally is 19 points. Looked like he was having fun out there, and his score reflects it. And that concludes tonight's three-point competition. One man stands alone with a shiny new trophy. Our winner, Ray Allen. And guys, this is always a highlight of the All-Star Weekend. No surprise to see another great event. And I think this is the one where the skills are so close in terms of what guys can do with the basketball shooting it that it's the most competitive event we have at the weekend. And that's what makes it so fun to watch. And we saw some tremendous shooting. The point contest always worth watching. And we thank you for being with us. So now for Greg Anthony, Brent Berry, and myself, Kevin Harlan, we'll see you next time.